Hi there, Tad Argo from Marketing for Hippies. And today I wanna to talk about this. The more uncomfortable the download is, the more comforting it will be for them. So here's what I mean by that. Uh, I was doing my 30 day uh, point of view marketing program. And there was a woman in it and she, well, we were digging into point of view. We were digging into how do they see their work. And she was seeing some things uh, in doing that work and, and all the reflecting, she was seeing, seeing some things that were very confronting to her, uh, very discomforting and uh, uncomfortable. It was, you know, she was kind of just getting the downloads from the universe and it was unsettling something inside her. It, it wasn't, you know, sometimes you get a download that's real comforting and ah, I feel at peace. And sometimes you get something that's like, oh, that's so true, but it's so painful to see. Oh my God. You know, um, you know, when I realized how much of the marketing and selling stuff I'd done when I was younger was um, just unethical, pushy, slimy, manipulative, it was, that was really hard to see. But the more uncomfortable it is for you to see it, the more comforting it'll be for somebody once you've metabolized it and you can put it out. It's um, because it'll, it'll be reliable. You know, I remember I've done uh, some studying with a fellow, Stephen Jenkinson, who did a lot of work in the death trade. And one of the things he found is, is this, this utter fear or resistance to saying the big, the D word, you know, the, um, you can't use the industrial strength D word of death, where they died. No, they passed on, they transitioned, they, they've moved on now, they, they've let go. And he just saw this. And it's a, so that's not an easy thing to see. Oh my gosh. But when you say it to other people who are in it, sometimes it's very confirmed. Like, oh my God, that's true. We just don't say that. I've been craving for somebody to just say it. You know, there's um, one of the stories Stephen tells us, he was visiting a man who had been a pilot and suddenly his health had deteriorated in six weeks. He was just skeleton, you know, almost. And he sat down with him and he said, uh, so he said, what's your understanding of what's happening right now? And the fellow said, he said well, I understand I'm very sick. And um, Stephen nodded and said, uh, is there anything else you would like to know that you're confused about? Or... And the guy looked up and he said, am I dying? And Stephen said, looked at him and said, yes, you are. And it's not just starting, you are well into it now. And he said, as he said that, the man's shoulders uh, relaxed. A sigh of relief came out. Why? Because he'd kind of suspected it, but nobody had been willing to say it to him. So these things that are uncomfortable for us to see, sometimes are very comforting for people to hear. You know, you see something that's very troubling about human beings and you just name it. And people say, oh, I thought that was just me. I thought I was alone. Wait, you mean there's a bigger pattern? It's not always pleasant to see these patterns, but they're immensely confirming to be on the receiving end of because they got some heft because they're based on something. They're based on real life experience. So anyways, this is just about point of view. If you get a, a kind of download or you see something and it's really unnerving for you to see it, uh, that same thing will steal the nerves. S-T-E-E-L. Yeah. It'll steal the nerves. It'll strengthen and solidify a person hearing it. Uh, it'll confirm something in them. It's a, a kind of empathy in a way. People are so desperate for people to be real with them. Uh, so even when it's a really unsettling thing to say, it's the thing that settles them. So hopefully that's helpful. Uh, if you like this video, please share it with your friends. You can uh, click subscribe uh, on the red button and then click the bell icon. You can find me at marketingfairpeace.com or on Facebook. And if you have any questions or reflections on this, you can put them in the comments below. I'd love to see them. Thanks so much.